If I was going to describe this town, I'd say it's a friendly and happy place. And the good thing about our school is that everyone's nice, so we can, well, all work together. When we set up Flitch Green, we wanted the school to be a, a hub for the community. And this is really what we've got. It's really a modern take of a primary school village. This school has been built from scratch. When we set up the curriculum, we had to think about the skills that the children were going to need for the 21st century. A lot of the things that we were seeing were not just about gaining knowledge, acquiring facts. You need to be able to do something with those facts. You need to have the skills to decipher, to evaluate, to collaborate with other people that you're working with. We knew from an early start that we wanted to develop a creative curriculum and we wanted technology to be integrated into our curriculum. It had to be part and parcel of what we did. What we found with the Apple products is that the children didn't have to worry about the technical side of things. They could just concentrate on their end product, what they wanted to say, what the message was, and use those tools to give that right message. You don't really need instructions to use it. You just type something, it comes up, or you click on something and you just get it in about three seconds. I think it's important that the children can go on and, and choose what technology they're going to use, the best tool for the job really. If they want to collaborate on a MacBook or do their research, they can. They could be more interactive with an iPad, which I think enthuses the children. It makes them want to learn. With the mobility, with the iPod, we can break down the walls of the classroom. They're learning through the technology, but don't always realise they're learning, which I think is a bonus. They're enjoying what they're doing, but learning at the same time. It's not so dull, and kids want fun ways of learning, and it's more interactive than a pen and paper. Think of a nursery rhyme that you might like to base your storytelling on. I think what's amazed us is the way the four or five year olds are just picking up the skills, the tools on the Apple Macs, the iPads and the iPod Touches at an incredibly quick rate. What I found is their independent learning has just accelerated at a rate that I would never have believed possible. I really couldn't see how Flitch Green Academy could teach the curriculum we offer to the children now without using Apple products. They're an integral part of what we do every single day. What we've wanted to do in the school is create an atmosphere where children feel very comfortable and secure because for us it's really important that children take a risk with their learning. That's how we learn the best when we do something that we thought we never could do before. We know that like, if you're taking a risk we know that we can always count on our teachers to help us. We have hope and we have our faith in them. I think that the children here, I think because of the curriculum we provide for them, the Apple technology we use, they want to come to school. You can see them at the gate every morning, aching to get in the, in the classroom. Um, they've got that enthusiasm, that desire to learn. And it's not just in the classroom. Parents are coming and saying they, they love coming to school. They're taking their learning home with them. So I think that, that real love of learning, if you like, that I think we're instilling in them. <laughs>